August 29th here, 2024 in Nisserus Crease. I'm looking at some of our fields here, and it's just amazing how um, they made a living out of these uh, plots of land. And you can see off to the right there the coast, the rocky coast, some beaches there. Um, and uh, just it's just incredible. Now I own some of these uh, fields, not many. I think there's two that I own in this area. But you know, they are a reminder and they are a connection to the past, that this is how we connect to our ancestors who we never really knew, many of them, maybe one or two generations back. And then these big blocks here are of course part of this uh, superstructure of a castle that was um, erected as a perimeter on the top of the island to ward off invaders, which were a frequent occurrence. You can see that corner up there getting ready to fall. But this also connects us to a more ancient past. And, uh, and we, uh, we might feel alone, we might feel abandoned, but we have connections if we look for them. I believe God's provided connections for us to the past and to the future through Jesus, of course. Um, and so there you have it. Just an amazing sight. It, um, it's impressive and um, it's amazing. And I, I hope you um, see, it, see it for what it does for you. And um, I just marvel at how these people could um, make gardens out of such rocky, barren hillsides. But they did it. They did it well. And I'm a result, I'm, I'm a fruit of that labor. My, uh, my existence and the fact that they could um, feed enough people to have me is just an amazing thing.